The number of videos I have made on the KSB2 bugs, the urge of making a patch notes video was insane. So here we have, the first patch notes after the game is released, these were uploaded on Friday on KSB forums. I hope they upload these on their other socials like Reddit and Instagram next time just like they upload everything else. Keep in mind patch notes are the key points of upcoming bug fixes small updates for a game. For example, PUBG had over 50 patch notes. They have divided the patch notes in four main sections. First is performance changes. In performance changes, they have reduced the time on the loading screen on minimum space machines. Low-end systems will have less time to load the game on the main menu. Next is the model of lights used on the runway are probably high geometry. Now they have changed it to normal. Next is less load on the CPU from engine exhaust. Maybe calculating that beautiful looking plume was heavy on your CPU. Now it won't be that intense. Next is less time spent on the UI by a single CPU thread. These are the updates that will increase some FPS. Next, some changes are done in the physics of the game. First, they solved the bug that was sending the KSC into orbit with our rocket. This was a hella strange bug. The second update is, they basically fixed the wobbling of the rocket when using an engine plate. Next, they fixed some stuff in a planned trajectory going inside the runway. I never saw this bug in the game, but it's nice to have it fixed. After this, they fixed the light having low radius issue, basically. The light was not throwing enough light, but they fixed it. And these are some small fixes they did. They are not that important to know, but you can read them as well. In the environment section, optimizing this will make a lot of boost in the FPS of the game. The issue involving the atmosphere and ocean disappearing has been solved. Next is placing correct collision boxes around the launch pad and space center props in game. Next issue regarding clouds of planets not viable for a distance is solved. Also Kerbin atmosphere not visible from Mun is solved. And some issue with Leitha, looking buggy on map view has been solved. Next section is changes made in UI. They have changed the camera issues. The middle click camera bug was solved. Other are some small bugs solved. You can see them though. But I can't see one bug that haunts me daily. Let me know if you have seen this bug. After pressing launch in the assembly building, when we go to the launch pad, the camera goes to the horizontal mode. I have to press the camera button five times to solve it. I request the developers to take a look into it. These are all the patches that will be in the next patch update. This is not the final list. Any update that is not listed can make its way in the update. After the game release, they collected all the responses they could get from players and logged each issue, they are actively trying to fix the issues. As we don't have any ticket raising process, they have to gather everything from forums and Reddit, Discord. These updates can't be rushed because they have limited time to solve a given issue. They don't want to create a new bug actively solving the current bug because they have an active working to-do list. They are developing the game and they have to solve issues at the same time in limited time. It's a stressful job. I can bet they will push these patch notes one by one making the game bug free. To get notified for all the KSB2 latest content, dock your ship with the subscribe button. It takes 2 seconds. And like this video also. I will see you guys in the next video.